Hello! I'm Ellen. I'm Brian, and today Ellen is going to be teaching you guys Red Velvet's new song, Bad Boy. Keep in mind that this video is mirrored, and feel free to change up the speed of this video using the YouTube settings down below. Remember to stretch before you begin. Yay! I'll be teaching the chorus of Bad Boy today, and I learned from Sergi. So we're going to start at 5, right before the chorus starts. So on 5, you're going to bring up both of your arms up, and make sure they're parallel to the ground. And then you don't move on 6, and then on 7, you're going to push both of your arms out. At the same time, bring out your right leg, and also look to the right side. So your head is tilting back and side, and looking towards your right side. So all together, it looks like this. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and then on eight, we're gonna bring back this right foot. At the same time, we're gonna twirl our wrists and hit this position on eight. So this is seven, eight. And then on seven, I also kind of lean back a little bit with my head and my upper body, and then I come back on eight. Okay, so all together from the top. One, two, three, four, five, six, Seven, eight. And moving on, this is when the chorus actually begins. So I'm going to teach the upper body first. You're going to have both of your arms swing to the right and then swing back. And then lower your arms, make these hands. So you're just pointing up with your index finger up. And then you're going to swing again to the right, swing back. The second one should be in front of your chin area. And the third one is a bit lower here. And this is in front of your stomach. So it goes. One, two, three, four, five, six, and then on seven, we're just gonna swing to the right. Both of our arms, and now they're back to fists again. So it goes one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So we're gonna have our right foot in front, and we're gonna have this motion where we put we shift our weight from our front leg to the back leg and front leg and back and forth. So every time on one, on the odd numbers, is when we're going to put our weight on the front leg. So it should look like this. It goes one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So we keep on doing this, and all together it should look like this. So we're here on eight. We go one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. I slightly turn my head this way a bit, so it goes one, two, and then on three, I lift up my chin, so it looks prettier, so it goes three, four, and then keep my head tilted, five, six, and then the seven, there's a slight hair flip, so it goes seven. Doesn't have to be super big, but just a little bit bigger. Make sure on seven, we completely shift the weight and we don't step back anymore, so we just land here on seven with our weight on our right foot. Okay, let's start from the top from here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. For the next eight count, we're gonna step out with our left foot and then step out with our right foot. So this is one, two, three, four. And for the upper body, we're gonna open our arms with our hands open. So we go one, two, cross and then you open and make sure both hands are fists. This is on three, four. On four, you flick up your hands while having your these three fingers out and these two should be together. So it's kind of like a gun. This, this is on three, four. So the upper body goes one, two, three, four. And adding on the feet, you go one, two, three, four. Okay, so make sure you also shift your weight to the left and then to the right. And then on five, we're going to step again with our left foot and have our hands go down. So they hit here and they slowly go down. This is on five, so we go five, six. And then on seven, we're just going to step our feet together by bringing the right foot in and we're going to go seven, eight. So their body angle slightly changed, so a little bit to the right for the hip on seven and then on eight is the other side. So let's go over this eight count. We're here on seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Let's go over from the top from here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five. 
five, six, seven, eight. Okay, next, I'm gonna shift this way a little bit because we're about to travel that way. So we end here on seven, eight, and we're gonna start walking that way, starting with our left foot. So we're gonna go left, right, left, right, left. So you're traveling that way for the first three steps, left, right, left, but for the fourth and fifth step, you're kind of just staying in place. And throughout this whole time, our body should be facing 45 that way. And as for the upper body, we're gonna have both of our hands up, and the thumbs should be out like this, and we're gonna go like this. So every time we step, we switch an arm. So for the first one, we're gonna step out with our left foot, which means our right hand's gonna go up. It goes one, two, three. So we're just gonna do this three, three times. Right, left, right. At the same time, you can add a little bit of body weight or a little bit of groove to this. So it goes one, two, three. Okay. And then on four, when we step together on four, we're gonna drop this left hand and our right hand is just gonna twirl right here. It's in between your shoulder and chin area right here. So we're just gonna twirl outwards on four and then twirl again on five while you hit this position and stop moving. So this is four, five. Okay, let's go over the upper body. So it goes one, two, three, four, five. And for the feet, it's left, right, left, right, left. So all together, it should look like five, six, seven, eight, one, two, three, four, five. And at the same time on five is when we're gonna put our left hand right here. Make sure your palm is facing the back. So the back of your hand is near your waist, and your right hand is here, your left hand is here. At the same time, as you step into this on five, you're gonna bring your hip around clockwise. So it goes from this direction around, and it's gonna hit in. So basically, your hip is up, and your hip is gonna hit back down 45 angle, and then come back right up. So this is on four, five, six is the twirl, Seven is when you hit, and eight, you just come back. Okay, let's go over this eight count. So starting from here, five, six, seven, eight, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And then moving on, we're gonna do this again, but this time we're walking that way, starting with our left foot. So we're gonna go left, right, left, right. And we're just shifting our balance, if you look, from this side, it should look like you're traveling like this, like a penguin or something. So you're just shifting away from left to right and back a little bit. As for our hands, we're gonna do the same hand as your feet. It might feel weird, but every time you're stepping on the left foot is when you're bringing your left hand up. So it goes like left, right, left, right. But while we're walking, we should still be facing that way. And we go one, two, three, four. So we just travel a little bit, and then on five, six, so we're gonna turn around to that side because that's what still keep it. So we're gonna go five, six. If you want to learn from another member, feel free to look at what they do. They all do a different pose here, so choose what you want to do. Okay, so after we go here on five, six, just pose here, and then on seven, eight, we're gonna turn around over our left shoulder and go seven, eight. So when you turn around, it's also left, right, and on eight, we're gonna shoot out our hands, both are these gun hands, and this is on eight. So make sure your arms are parallel to the ground and they're like straight right in front of you. Let's go over everything from the top slowly with count, and then we'll do 75% speed music and then full speed music. So starting with this move, ready? One, two, three, four, five, six, Seven, eight. 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 
One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. We are now halfway done with the chorus, so we end it here on eight, and then on one, we're gonna have our hip go to the right, go down and around and up, and we're gonna do this smooth three times in a row. So it goes one, two, three, four, five, six. And then on seven, eight, we're still going to the right, but our knees won't bend anymore. So we're just gonna shift our weight to our right leg. So all together, it should look like one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And for our upper body, so we end it here on eight. On one, two, we're not gonna move anything. So we're gonna do one, two, and then on three, four, we're going to draw our left hand and have our right hand go to our mouth and have your index finger up. So it's like shh. And it's going to go from your mouth slowly up and straight up throughout this whole encount. So from here, seven, eight, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And also one little note for this encount is when you're doing this, your left hand can pat here on the odd count. So it goes one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So every time on three, five, and seven, it's just gonna go like this. Okay, so we end it here on eight. And then for the next eight count, we're gonna drop both of our arms and hide them so they don't hang on the side. And on one, we're just gonna step to the left and bend both of our knees. So this is one, two, three, four. On one and three, it's exactly the same, just left and right. And then on five, we're gonna step together with our left foot. We don't move anything for our feet for the rest of the eight count. So if there's only three steps for this eight count, it goes five, six, seven, eight, one, two, three, four, five. Okay, so that's left for left for the feet. And as for the upper body, we're not gonna do anything for the first two counts, so this is just one, two. And then on three, when we step with our right foot, our hands are going to be open and close. So you're just going to touch your chest on three. And then after you touch three, four, on five, it's just going to slowly go down. This is on five, six. And on seven, eight, we're going to go seven, eight. At the same time, our body orientation is slightly changing, so it goes seven, eight. Some of them move their heels, but some of them don't because they're wearing high heels. So it'll be easier if you just move a little bit of your hip. Okay, so let's go over this eight count. We're here on seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So moving on for the next eight count, we're gonna do this move again, but without the feet that we did last time. So for our upper body, it's gonna go right up, left up, right up. So it's gonna go one, two, three. On four, drop the left arm. Your right wrist twirls and set on five. So it twirls twice. Four, five. So on five, make sure it doesn't move anymore. Let's go over the upper body. It goes one, two, three, four, five. So this is where you should stop for the upper body. And as for the lower body, we're not gonna step. We're just kind of bounce a little bit. So our body will be slightly towards the left side, just a little bit, as well as our head. And we're gonna go one, two, three, by four, your body should go back to the regular position again. So it goes one, two, three, four, five. On five, we're gonna do what we did before, which is bring up our left wrist here, and also bring our hip around on five, six, seven, eight. So this is exactly the same as that previous eight count when we did this move. So going over this eight count, five, six, seven, eight, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Make sure when you do this move, you can bounce a little bit and make sure to have your body to the left, go to the right. And also one more note is to make sure your arms have a little bit of tension. So they're not just like doing this, but put a little bit of tension for the texture of your arm movements. 
Also, when we do 7A, make sure our body completely turns to this side. So our left side of our body should be facing forward. We're here on 7A, and then we're going to go 1. So basically, we're shifting our weight from left to right for the next few A counts. And our left hand is going to be here for the whole time. And our right hand, you're going to have your thumbs out, and you're going to be doing this. So you're drawing circles counterclockwise. And at the beginning of every beat, it should start from the top of the circle and go to the left and around. So you're just going to draw four circles with your right hand, and our feet are going to go right, left, right, together. And by right, I mean the right leg going up. So right, left, right, together. And one tip would be um, to have your upper body to have a good posture, so your shoulders can go back a little and have your chest go out. So while you're doing this move, you can utilize your shoulder a bit to make it more cute or drilly. So all together, it should look like this. So we're here on seven, eight, one, two, three, four. Okay, so after you draw that fourth circle, we're going to step left, right. Have both of our legs straight, but our weight is steadily towards the left side. And as you do left, right, our arms are going to go out, in. And this is on five, six. But depending on which number you're going to learn from, this pose can be different. So after we do five, six, on seven, eight, which is when they sing bad boy, on seven, we're going to lift up our head on seven and bring it down on eight. So it goes seven, eight. Okay, so let's go over this eight count. We're here on seven, eight, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Let's go over the second half of the chorus. So starting from here, seven, eight, one, two, three, four, five, six, 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 seven, eight. We're gonna drop our level and put our weight entirely on the left side. So on our left knee, we're just going to bend down and kind of sink down. At the same time, your head should be falling backwards and sideways. So this way. So it goes one, two, and then immediately after, we're going to go to the other side and shift our weight. So we're going to shift our weight from the left side to the right side. And for our arms, we're here. We go down, and then it's just going to go down and it should be right in front of both of your thighs. So it goes one, two, three, four. And for the next few moves, we're just going to extend our left leg and bring it in and repeat this. So every time you go up, you straighten your right leg and you put out your left leg. And then you go back down is when you bring your left leg in. So to repeat this, it goes one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So we are going to do this leg four times. So we're here on seven, eight. We go one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four. So we stop on four. And one detail is that on seven, we're gonna have both of our hands go like this, and then we're gonna do it again on three. Okay. So let's do it together. We're here on seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six. Seven, eight, one, two, three, four. We're gonna step out with our left foot and kick our right foot up. So it goes five, six, then seven, eight, one, two, three. So you're gonna do it three times. So you go left, kick, right, kick, left, kick, yep. And as for the upper body, we're gonna go, this is on five, so we go five, we just do this, so five, six, Seven is when we cross and open, have both of your hands as fists, and then we're gonna flick up. So we go five, six, seven, eight, and then on one, we're gonna go down again. So we go one, two, three, four. Okay, so let's put those moves together. We were here on three, four, and then we're gonna go five, six, seven, eight, one, two, three. 
And depending on who you're going to learn from, they might do the opposite side, but this is what Sogi does. Okay, so let's go over that again. So we're here on three, four, five, six, seven, eight, one, two, three. It's a bit hard to do it slow, but when you do it with music, it should be more bouncy. So you can bounce every time and have your hip go out every time you kick. Okay. So we're here on four, and we're going to do these steps like left, right, left, and then left, right, left. So that's on five, six, seven, eight, one, two, three. Okay. And as we're stepping, our body is slowly going to turn that way throughout this whole eight count. And every time we step, make sure our hip moves with it too. So it should look like this. We're here on four, and we go five, six, seven, eight, one, two, three. Make sure we end with our body facing that way and hip out. Okay, as for the upper body, five, six, seven. On seven, we drop both of our hands, have them right on your shoulders, and have your head go up and lean back and lean slightly towards the left side. We still look forward. So it goes through here. It goes five, six, seven, eight, and then one, two, three. On the three, our hands are going to go drop, go down, and come here on the back of your body. So we're here on four, we go five, six, seven, eight, one, two, three. So we end here with our hands here and our left hip out. And then on the five, six, seven, eight, which is the last part of this part, we're just going to walk towards our next formation and reset our bodies. And that is the end of what I'm teaching today. Yay! Let's review the second part of the chorus with count, and then slowly with music, and then full speed music. Okay, so going from here, seven, eight, one, two, three, four, five, six, 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 seven, eight. 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 Five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, 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 five, six, seven, eight. Five, six, seven, eight, one, two, three, four, 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 five, six, seven, eight. We're going to review everything that we learned today from the top slowly with counts and then with 75% speed music and then full speed music. Okay, so starting with this move, ready? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. 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 One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight.
One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Thank you guys for learning this dance with me today. Please support Red Velvet and the new song Bad Boy. Also, huge thanks to Kudin for the skirt that I'm wearing today. If you're interested, please click the links down below in the description box. Don't forget to subscribe, like, and comment. Bye-bye!